Michael is our 10 year old and he eats, sleeps and breathes soccer. He loves it, it's everything for him. And his wish was to go meet Riyad Mahrez. With the Leicester City Football Club over in Leicester, England. They're my favorite team and I really liked Mahrez. So I thought if I could train with him, it would be really fun. And the actual wish, you know, turned out to be you know, that and much, much more, which was amazing. We went across to, to England and we went to Leicester City and Michael actually got to go and watch the team's training session the day before the game. My favorite part was going one-on-one -on -one with Mares. We were playing like kind of pair notes where you had to meg each other. I was shooting on him, he was shooting on me, and we were just showing skills. That was the thing that Michael wanted more than anything. They played with him, they juggled, they passed the ball around, he shot on Riyad, Riyad shot on him. And I was kind of surprised. I thought I would just be going to England and training with him and going coming back, but we got to go to a game, I got to walk out of the tunnel with him. And for another 31,000 people at the beginning of the game, walk out on the field with the players, kind of go through the lineup, shake everybody's hand, get an official picture, even knock the ball around on the field with a couple of the players, like literally a minute or two before kickoff. And then up into the stands, we went to watch the game. He doesn't talk about it much, but I think he thinks about it quite frequently. It's still fun when I go to bed and I try to fall asleep, I think of playing with Mars, and that usually knocks me out. He wrote thank you notes to everybody that was involved in it. He wrote the thank you notes in his own words, and he would say things like, thank you for giving me you know, the best day of my life. You can't stop a chronic disease, but you can fill it and infuse it with light and life and good things. To be able to see him in that moment and just how much joy he had from doing that, it was unbelievable. To see that twinkle in your kid's eye about something that brings them so much joy, it's priceless. And if you can do that for a child battling a disease, a disorder, that twinkle is everything.